The big yellow structure behind us is the offshore test concepts. Um, and we developed the uh, uh, offshore living lab uh, for the past two years in cooperation with our partners. And it's actually one of the first steps in bringing uh, offshore solar panels and the structure supporting them to uh, real offshore conditions. As we know, wind turbine generators are growing increasingly, which means that the space in between them is also growing exponentially, which leads to the question, can we use this space in a more efficient manner? And that's where solar panels came in, because the idea is to actually integrate the solar panels in existing and new offshore wind farms, and thus increase the energy density of these wind farms. At the same time, employing solar and wind energy um, together could lead to a reduction in maintenance costs as opposed to using these two technologies separately. This is actually only a scale model and it's on a scale of about one-fourth of the full scale. So the full scale will measure about 35 by 35 meters. One of the strengths of this design is that we can use regular solar panels. In the full scale designs, the, uh, the solar panels will be elevated above the water surface as such that even waves and storm conditions cannot reach them. We included several configurations in the solar panels. For instance, we use different inclination angles, we uh, use solar panels facing different wind directions, we're cleaning them in different intervals, etc. At the same time, we do expect some storms uh, during the winter times. So we will get a lot of uh, interesting data into uh, the performance of these solar panels in offshore conditions. We designed and installed in-house biofacilitating anchors along with several research buoys. And this is because we really want to establish which kind of materials do we use that can promote the growth of marine life on these anchors and around them of course. And in the end to come to a system that has a net positive ecosystem value. For the offshore test concept, the anchors will already be in place by the time we tow the structure out to sea. All we'll have to do in the open sea is connect the structure to the anchors. We ran into a lot of challenges, as we of course will have on innovation projects, but in the end we could use the expertise of all of our colleagues to really get to, a, get to something that we can be proud of. And I think once this is installed, we'll have something that we can really be proud of as a team.